Hello and welcome to episode 51 of our RimWorld playthrough on the Tundra. Oh boy. We have uh, a few things to take care of. First things first, I want to mention I will be batch recording the next couple episodes. I'm coming down with a cold and I'm not sure if I'll be able to make uh, all my recordings this week um, and some other stuff going on. Uh, I'm, I'm just going to batch record the next uh, week's worth of episodes. Um, so if you put comments on this particular video, um, I, I won't be able to get them until episode uh, 54. Uh, but I still will read them and I'll get back to you. But if you're telling me to like make a change or uh, have a suggestion about something specific, um, don't be surprised if I seem to completely ignore it in the last one. But uh, from the comments, um, it was recommended to get a little more room in the barn by deconstructing uh, some of the space here. So I'm doing that. Now, this should be noted that our um, we have limestone ground here. So um, I don't know if this will actually give us much more space anyways. We get a little bit there. Um, and I don't want to go all the way down here. I think mostly this is limestone under here anyways. But it does kind of open things up a little bit. Just let the animals kind of move a little bit more freely. We could, if we really cared about it too, um, put most of our growing spots up here. And what I could also do is maybe move the heater down here, maybe even knock out this spot um, and put it on the limestone and, and kind of wall it in a little bit more because the heater has enough light that it will kill um, a small area around it when it comes to mushrooms just because of the light. Now, that little quest popped up. Helper outsourcing. Uh, we could send a couple of colonists away for additional honor. Might not be a terrible idea. Um, we have uh, defenses look like they're fully rebuilt, which is great. We have an idle, uh, idle colonist, not the best. We have Kriegsmen who were in the process of converting. So that's fairly low. Um, Spanky has a uh, bonus conversion up. That's a nice down 69. Nice. Uh, lowering that. We do want Kriegsman back sooner than later um, because we need wood. Drunken Cat is probably going to be grumpy because the uh, undignified throne room and the undignified bedroom. And uh, we, we're waiting for this cotton to grow and then we can finally finish up the bedroom. We also want steel and components here. Now, I've mentioned that for a while. So let's just get a whole bunch of metal mined. I know our main mining person was Kriegsman, so that means we do need to push Drunken Cat outside her comfort zone um, and get some mining done. So we'll, we will do that. Um, some sandstone chunks in there. Look at all these animals. So many little chicks and chickens and we're getting a nice supply of eggs now. This is going to be a great source of income for us. And uh, yeah, getting some steel through some smelting. Um, pretty soon we'll get two research benches going and then that will get us ever closer to being able to get those star flight systems on the way. So I'm hoping uh, we are going to get there sooner rather than later. Um, I think I'm actually going to just turn off the the mining for now um maybe it's expand this a little bit and uh i think we'll haul all these out of here i get somebody somebody to do um spanky kriegsman tried to convert spanky okay uh we're back to 67 um kriegsman is very adamant about their beliefs which is not the best um gonna take a, a hot minute I think now public execution is definitely not what we want do a little war advent that could be fun I probably could build a couple more speakers in here and that would uh, increase increase the quality of our little rituals um, we should probably also get a couple extra like neil cloths but we don't have um, don't have materials for that unless 
Could we make these out of something a little better? Good. Make them out of muffalo wool. I feel like that would be fairly thematic as well. Uh, on the tundra, something nice and nice and cozy. Kind of just place these like all around. Get some nice ones. We could even deconstruct these maybe, and that would let us get the uh, the carpet. Cause we we do have a whole bunch of muffalo wool. And as I say it, I'm thinking, what a great idea. And so, let it be done. Look at that. We're just immediately turning these into carpet. Beautiful. Exactly what we want. Carpet is almost finished. We have these Neil pillows all around. Oh, and an exotic goods trader. Um, drunken cat, why don't you come up here? We'll talk to the exotic goods trader. Get a little bit of trading happening. See if we can make some additional money. I mean, at this point, we can also just sell... Sell some animals. We have... Uh, gold, yes. Oh, that's... That's a, a lot of gold. We need a lot of gold. So we'll keep hens, we'll keep roosters. Um, get rid of the cockerel. I think that's enough, right? Two roosters and two hens is probably, maybe we'll keep another hen. Um, buffalo, yeah. Do we want to get rid of all the eggs? No, surely they're useful. Um, we'll keep a little bit of tea. And then otherwise we need that's a lot of money. So what if we did like 60 gold? Okay. Now in terms of, this takes 90. So I need another, uh, was it 90 and 40? So that's a lot of gold. I still I need another 70 gold. All right, how are we gonna get 70? 70, 70 gold is another 800. Um. I mean, I could sell some yaks. Uh, I've sold, they, they don't want, I mean, I, I think I have a lot of chicks too. So I probably could sell. I'm gonna sell the baby yak. Um, what if I uh, uninstall all of these? No. There we go. Okay. Uninstall those. And boom. We want another 70. We need 300 yet. Sell the calf. Sell calf. That's enough. Perfect. So we're going to make a lovely set of recon prestige armor. I think that's neat. Um, I mean, I probably could wait to get the uh, marine prestige armor, which is a little bit better. Um, there's a lot. So. Um, I think we'll just get the recon armor, right? Good enough. It's fine. Yeah, I like it. It looks very cool. And we can we can get it now and it's, it'll be sufficient for drunk for our purposes. Um, we have how much we can do now. Really, we're waiting for uh, this ideologin to take over and that will be wonderful. Um, it is very slow though. Holy smokes. Um, are we going to get a little, what are we doing? Polar yours. No, don't let polar do the converting. This is the problem, right? Oh, I, I clicked the wrong one already converting. Feel free. 
to put your clothes back on. That is hilarious. Apparently, that was uh, Spanky's conversion strategy is just take off all of Kriegsman's armor. Um, I mean, actually not a terrible strategy in terms of uh, not letting the prisoner have armor because we did have a, a prison break last time and it might make it easier to subdue a prisoner if they decide to go berserk or something. And Kriegsman is a little bit more threatening um, than Polar, who is a pacifist and is mostly incompetent at fighting. Now, we do have a ship chunk. Uh, we have a decent amount of um, components in reserve. We are getting close to the number of s steel we need. Um, Llama is working on this recon helmet. Llama is capable of crafting, so we're going to let, let that one go through. Um, I see Edgar took advantage of Kriegsman's uh, breastplate on the ground there, the flak vest, and he took an opportunity to snag a little upgrade. Good for you. Put this down. Um, I think we could also details and make this out of sandstone and pause the wood for now because wood is kind of a more important commodity. We have so much sandstone with those drills. We'll kind of put these back up here. Llama is going to go away at that. And all these brazers and things are going to go away. Okay, we have enough steel. Next, we need the components. So we, we will just mine another strip of components. Drunken Cat is on the job. Okay, we're not going to grab all of them, I guess. That's a thing. Oh, drunk, we're grabbing literally enough just to build um, and now that that's ready to go we're just gonna go to sleep except we're not we're gonna manually build gorgeous that's ready to go sorry for interrupting your sleep so much I don't know if these are both kind of hooked up to that. Um, hopefully. Hopefully they are. I also need to ex continue to expand the carpet in here. Once I get enough cloth. But Drunken Cat now has um, just the throne room. It's undignified. Everything else is fine. That is a lot of chickens. I have a lot of chickens that have hatched. That is fantastic. That will be a good source of income. I just need to make sure, I probably should have just sold all the chickens last time because we definitely have more than enough female chicks um, and male chicks done, yeah. Um, more than enough that will kind of propagate. Down to 57. Polar. You don't get to warden anymore because um, you're not very good at it. So don't do it. Okay. Okay. Sad wander. Okay. Kriegsman is, is having a rough go. And we have another plague. Even more plagues. Oh, Polar's there. Drunken Cat, there. Um, you were just... Uh, okay. Health. Yeah. Immunity is going up faster. We're good. Immunity is higher. We're good. If things get dire, I was also reminded in the last... Oh, uh, no. We need to rest until healed. What are you doing? Um, yeah, you know, you do not have time to be wandering around. Yeah, we do have... Oh, no. Why are you on an insulting spree, drunken cat? You're going to die. For real, though. 
You don't have time to be insulting the prisoners, especially a prisoner who's having a sad wander in our very sad prison. Um, I mean, come on. Like, your mood isn't even that bad. Randy, why you gotta give Drunken Cat the crazy plague? Um, Spanky, we will have to use your Preach Health on Drunken Cat as soon as Drunken Cat gets over it. And hopefully Drunken Cat doesn't go uh, berserk all night um, and lose their immunity advantage here, which actually is not too bad. Polar, what are you doing out of bed? I thought I had everybody prioritized to bed rest. I really didn't. Okay. Bed rest is number one. You do nothing else. You literally have nothing to worry about. People will take care of you. Except for Drunken Cat. Who's just going to berate the prisoner? Do we have any... Okay, Spanky, you're a warden. Um, I, I could... Chuck, worst case scenario, I actually could throw Drunken Cat into the Bio Sculptor. Um, Kriegsman is having such a sad wander. I mean, we've been wandering. Oh, great. Um, yeah, use the good stuff, Drunken Cat. There we go. Um, compacted steel. Convenient. Even more next to more, even more steel. So we have a little lot of steel. Um, okay, slimy guy, you don't get to wear the prestige helmet. Yeah, I need to set the permissions up and, and not let anyone wear anything. So, slimy guy, edit anything, headgear, uh, armor, I should say. And we are going to not allow. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, we're going to not allow any of that fancy stuff. Um, noble apparel. Where's the... Uh, let's find headgear. There it is. You do not get to wear any of this cool hat stuff. Put that back. That is not for you. It's good. It's even a good one. Which means it actually has really good like we're it's a it's essentially bulletproof that helmet. And slimy guy is wearing it out as we speak. So you don't get to wear it. This is this is for drunken cat. Um yeah, put your beret away. You get to have a fancy helmet. Now, we also need to watch this. Okay, so immunity's doing great. Immunity's even better because you weren't up all night swearing at your neighbor. Um, component is needed here in the battery. And I think we are out of regular components. Now, in terms of the recon armor, we need uranium. We, we have that somewhere. I remember. Build, not a copy. We want to move it. Um, I go to the tool. It's right here. Uranium is with the animals. So let's move this friend. Reinstall. Here. I should have put it facing the other way just to save my pawns going around it, but good enough. Kriegsman, how's your health? I got beat up by Drunken Cat a little bit. I mean, Drunken Cat is just pretty good across the board, fighting and everything. Um, also, apparently Drunken Cat is feeling capable of just getting out of bed. Oh, it's because I I see why. I see what's happened. It's Drunken Cat's bed rest um, is a one, but Doctor is, is a one as well. So Drunken Cat will prioritize doctoring others before resting in bed. That... That is the problem. But look at this. Okay, we have a near infinite amount of chickens. Um, chickens are potentially like I, I, I need to maybe keep an eye on the chickens. Um, food is, is looking great. We have lots of meals, still a decent amount of meat. Um, the eggs are rotting away. Hatches. 
Um, maybe we take the unfertilized eggs and we put them in the fridge. Interesting. I don't know. I don't know the best way to store RimWorld eggs. But oh boy, we have a mechanoid cluster. Ho ho ho. Okay. And it's a psychic suppressor. Slugger turret. Hot charge. Okay, you know what? Um, I'm batch recording these and looking at the time. Now's an appropriate time to pause the episode. And uh, we will deal with this problem right now. Well, not for you. For you. Maybe it's for you if you're watching this later and you're watching the whole playlist. It's going to be right now or, or very shortly. Um, but if you're watching this on Monday, we're going to deal with this next time on Wednesday. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, and I will catch you in the next one.